plate, excuse me, my rosary is tangled up. Get that untangled. So, <clears throat> pardon me, I have a little tickle in my throat today. All right. Good deal. Live on Instagram, live on Facebook, everything's going great. It's kind of a cloudy day today, but it's still a beautiful day. It's cooler, which is odd for the middle of April. Hey, Colby, welcome. I'm running a little behind today. So, but we're still getting there. It's nice and cool outside, so I have on my sweatshirt today. Figured I might as well take advantage because, hi Gina, welcome back. Welcome back. Yeah, it's a tiny bit chilly. Not really, but a little bit. Enough that I think I can get away with my sweatshirt today because, you know, it's going to be the last day. Hi Lucia, hello. Hello Mary, welcome. Wonderful. It's odd for it to be chilly this late in April. My mother-in-law, Carmen, uh, texted last night about 10.30 to tell me that it was snowing in Oklahoma. I heard it was snowing in Lubbock also. It's amazing. But no whining, no complaining. <laughs> when it's 100 degrees in a couple of weeks, we'll all be wishing we were in chilly weather. So, say la vie. <laughs> We'll find happiness wherever we are. <laughs> oh, um, Before I forget, tomorrow evening, Wednesday, April 15th, we're going to start a weekly Bible study at 8 p.m. on um, Facebook Live. Deacon Mike and I are going to go through the Gospel of Matthew, so I want to invite all of you to join us for that. Um, if you can't join us live at 8 o'clock, I will be uploading all of the videos after we finish um, onto YouTube. So if you miss one or you have friends maybe that don't have Facebook and you think they might like to join us, um, all the Bible study videos will be on the uh, my YouTube channel and I'll put the link out also for you to share with people so that um, we can, uh, so that we can Go through the Gospel of Matthew together. Um, we just finished the uh, letter, uh, Paul's letter to the Philippians. So we're going to, then we did a Triduum study. So now we're going to hop into the Gospel of Matthew. We did the Gospel of Luke during December. Hey, Mary, welcome. Um, so, see your Matthew anyway. So we're going to dive into the Gospel of Matthew and then maybe we'll just keep doing something every Wednesday evening um, even beyond because we I've got it set we'll start tomorrow on April 15th at 8 p.m. Central Time uh, doing that live Bible study of the Gospel of Matthew and we'll go I think we'll probably wind up finishing the end of June just because Matthew is a pretty big gospel so uh, in order to do it justice it will probably take us all the way through um, the end of June so more things for you to do during this pandemic time hopefully we won't have to be doing it because of pandemic in June but we want to finish the gospel so you know we'll just keep trucking along until we get it finished so all right well it's 3.06 and today is our fifth day. Things are going by so quickly. Today is our fifth day of the Novena to the Divine Mercy. So fifth out of our nine days in preparation for Divine Mercy Sunday. Today, today Jesus asked St. Faunus, oh, sorry, today Jesus asked St. Faustina, Today, bring to me the souls of those who have separated themselves from the church. 
Most merciful Jesus, goodness itself, you do not refuse light to those who seek it of you. Receive into the abode of your most compassionate heart the souls of those who have separated themselves from your church. Draw them by your light into the unity of the church, and do not let them escape from the abode of your most compassionate heart. Br bring it about that they too come to glorify the generosity of your mercy. Eternal Father, turn your merciful gaze upon the souls of those who have separated themselves from your son's church, who have squandered your blessings and misused their, your graces by obstinately persisting in their errors. Do not look upon their errors, but upon the love of your own son and upon his bitter passion, which he underwent for their sake. Since they too are enclosed in his most compassionate heart, bring it about that they also may glorify your great mercy for endless ages. Amen. In the name of the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit, amen. You expired, Jesus, but the source of life gushed forth for souls, and the ocean of mercy opened up for the whole world. O fount of life, unfathomable divine mercy, envelop the whole world, and empty yourself out upon us. O blood and water, which gushed forth from the heart of Jesus as a fount of mercy for us, I trust in you. O blood and water, which gushed forth from the heart of Jesus as a fount of mercy for us, I trust in you. O blood and water, which gushed forth from the heart of Jesus as a fount of mercy for us, I trust in you. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. I believe in God, the Father Almighty, creator of heaven and earth, and in Jesus Christ, his only Son, our Lord, who was conceived by the Holy Spirit, born of the Virgin Mary, suffered under Pontius Pilate, was crucified, died, and was buried. He descended into hell. On the third day he rose again from the dead. He ascended into heaven and is seated at the right hand of God the Father Almighty. From thence he shall come to judge the living and the dead. I believe in the Holy Spirit, the Holy Catholic Church, the communion of saints, the forgiveness of sins, the resurrection of the body, and life everlasting. Amen. <clears throat> Eternal Father, I offer you the body and blood, soul and divinity of your dearly beloved Son, our Lord Jesus Christ, in atonement for our sins and those of the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, 
have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. Eternal Father, I offer you the body and blood, soul and divinity of your dearly beloved Son, our Lord Jesus Christ, in atonement for our sins and those of the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. Eternal Father, I offer you the body and blood, soul and divinity of your dearly beloved Son, our Lord Jesus Christ, in atonement for our sins and those of the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. <clears throat> For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. Holy God, 
No. Eternal Father, I offer you the body and blood, soul and divinity of your dearly beloved Son, our Lord Jesus Christ, in atonement for our sins and those of the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. Eternal Father, I offer you the body and blood, soul and divinity of your dearly beloved Son, our Lord Jesus Christ, in atonement for our sins and those of the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. For the sake of his sorrowful passion, have mercy on us and on the whole world. Holy God, Holy Mighty One, Holy Immortal One, have mercy on us and on the whole world. Holy God, Holy Mighty One, Holy Immortal One, have mercy on us and on the whole world. Holy God, Holy Mighty One, Holy Immortal One, have mercy 
mercy on us and on the whole world. Eternal God, in whom mercy is endless and the treasury of compassion inexhaustible, look kindly upon us and increase your mercy in us that in difficult moments we might not despair nor become despondent, but with great confidence submit ourselves to your holy will, which is love and mercy itself. Amen. In the name of the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. God bless you all. Thank you so much for joining me in prayer today. Um, it's just such a joy. And I so appreciate you joining me and, and lifting up our world in prayer through this Divine Mercy Chaplet in preparation for Divine Mercy Sunday. God bless you. I will see you um, tonight at 7 o'clock for the Rosary on Facebook and uh, tomorrow at 3 p.m. on Instagram and Facebook for the Divine Mercy Chaplet. God bless you. Thank you.